Oh, I defended the camp. Good on me. And the game crashed. Hey, my computer didn't crash that time. I'll take it. I should get the 3DS version of Majora. I need more games for my 3DS, because it's a great system, and it's got great games. But all I have is Pokemon right now. Yeah, we are getting the true stalker experience here. Not, not too many crashes, but just every now and then. I wonder if that's gonna happen twice. Also, I should have looked at the output log and see if that's something I could diagnose. Well, if you liked waiting for the uh, military ambush, you're gonna love this portion where I just wait and hope that this fucker is walking towards me. Yeah? You want, you want to do this right now? You want to do this right now, huh? Those are boars. There are... Uh, I don't think there are any bears in the zone. No. Yeah, true. The Pokemon games are good. I'm not into them nearly as much as a lot of people are, but I still... I should start up a new run. Because I'm not going to finish. I'm on, like, the post-game in one run, and I really don't care anymore. And I guess I'm starting to realize that part of the point of that game is building your team from scratch. And, like, finding new, new little Pokemon buddies you like and trying new combinations and things. So, uh, I shouldn't feel bad about starting a new game, even if I haven't finished my first one. Good night, Sakura. What is this shit? I mean, okay, here's some good evidence against timed missions right here. Is like, what the fuck is going on with this shit? I, I can't... I don't think I can even toss a grenade far enough to maybe, like, upset them and make them think, Hey! Standing still is boring. Let's do something exciting. Like walk towards the source of these gunshots. Oh, please, let that be a head cresting the hill, please. Nope. Oh, 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 it's a leaf. I see. Come on, he's got the... He's got the two-shot Obicon. Same lethal. I'm, t I'm trying everything I can here. Here, I'll even try taking my daily supplements. Probably have about just as much effect as everything else I've done. <laughs> Why didn't I think of that? <laughs> Just leave some vodka and peanut butter on the doorstep. I have so many wild stalkers. I can't tell. Has he moved? He hasn't moved. Not a big old stinking inch. <laughs> 
throw a paper airplane. And if I stick, if I stick just like the tiniest piece of a gravity anomaly on it, it might fly forever. That'd be something to see. Are they... Are they in the tunnel? There's no fucking way they're in the tunnel. There's no reason for them to be in the tunnel. But let's check the tunnel. I'm surprised the building fire alarm doesn't... Oh, thank you, phone. I'm surprised the building fire alarm doesn't alert the fire department. That seems like uh, safety oversight. Yeah, they're not in the tunnel. You know what? I will grab that meat chunk. If nothing else. left and not a sign of these guys hey here's a question does anyone know if Oh, you see, were they active for a moment there, or is that why it was pulsing? Yeah. I was going to ask if anyone knows of any mods that use the, uh, the open source female stalker model that was made. Turn this game into slightly less of a sausage fest. Because, like, last I checked, that thing was, uh fully formed and ready to go. It maybe be a little weird to hear masculine voices, but I hate these guys so much. They're just trapped in limbo. <laughs> yes, we turned it into a diet sausage fest. They're they're probably trapped in limbo. They come online for half a second after a zone transition and then and then they're loading again. <laughs> Maybe the bandit with the gun, his game crashed. Ugh. Oh, sorry to waste your time, everyone. I was just hoping I might be able to complete that mission. Maybe, just maybe a little bit. Oh, well. I'm not upset. Nope. No, everything's good. It's all good. I don't particularly care. I already completed the mission to defend the camp anyway, so... I'm sorry, is that guy standing right beside me? Sure sounds like it.
Oh, you know it was nice though. We had a really good Thanksgiving dinner last night. There was ham and pierogies, cabbage rolls, creamed corn and peas, coleslaw, and uh, ice cream for dessert. So uh, everyone had a good time. We all ate some good food, and now we've got just this giant ham butt sitting in the fridge. So that's going to be a good week. Oh yeah, I'd, I'd buy that, Shima. Just the voice, getting a female voice actor is too difficult, so they're just like, ah, women don't exist. If nothing else, game, can I be lucky enough to get Baron's 545 Groza? I would accept that trade-off, that I don't get the two-shot, and instead I get the Groza. Crossing my fingers. Hmm. Well, it, Onion, you might be thinking of the, um, the flavor text from the encyclopedia here. These are actually, um, a lot of this text is kind of neat and interesting to read. There is one story with a female scientist in it, as part of just the uh, folklore. So you might be thinking of that. But it's also possible they did implement that female NPC. It's just I haven't encountered them or heard of that before now. I'm going to grab that sausage. I should carry at least one sausage with me at all times. Bork, bork. Uh oh, uh oh, I made a goof. Okay. I might be okay. I might be okay. see like part of the model of the pseudo dog just like oh stick out like that when it does the chewing animation ah don't worry about an onion we're glad to have you here take it easy dude <laughs> the big one's eating my binoculars <laughs> I love it Oh, those doggies. They're so hungry. Why isn't anyone giving them kibble? Maybe the stalkers eat kibble because they don't have any other food. All right, come on. Oh. That latency spike does not help. I made it through this time. <gasps> Are you ready, everyone? We're gonna meet our favorite friend again. Get out of here, stalker. Get out of here, stalker. 
You know he's in a good mood when he says it more than once. Oh, is that Baron? Buddy. Hey, buddy. Here you got something for me. Oops. Oops, oops, oops. But, uh... This is pretty much what I'm going for. It's sick. It's got accuracy. But, uh... Kind of put myself in a bad position now, so... <laughs> Aww! Anomaly, that's... Anomaly! A... First off, great name. Secondly, good dogs. Oh, come on. They didn't care before when I stabbed one of their friends in the face. Now all of a sudden, because it's this guy, they're like, Ooh, you can't stab him in the face or we're going to shoot you in the butt. I wonder if it has to do with line of sight. Hey guys, just hanging out with my good friend here. Don't worry, there's nothing, nothing going on. We're just hanging out. No worries about any kind of... Damn it! They really don't like me killing him. And I can't understand why. Uh, at least we can chillax at the bar here. Enjoy the music and the endless chatter. Black Raven, Black Raven, circling. Yasha Feather. Damn it, if only someone helped. So, Mark what? You brought the documents from X-18? Oh, the situation is becoming clearer. As I expected, this brain scorcher is man-made. It's a Kamenov experimental emitter, and its components mm. were made exactly in X-18. These documents refer to Lab X-16, where they sent some components. Do you respect According me? to this, X-16 is located in the production complex area by Lake Yenta. The scientists have set up a mobile lab yes, that's fate. so maybe they can help. It ain't simple. You need to get to the scientists and find out where X-16 is, so you can get the missing documents. So, are you up for it? Peace off. Oh, I might get something better for this night, Star Trade. In let's see. Oh, that might be worth it. The barrel armored suit. It's got the shitty night vision, but yeah, I'm okay with that. We needed to get rid of this monolith suit anyway. Oh, I could buy this. I've got the money for it. it. Does the most damage. Can't help but to take up and I'm gonna be moving over to five five six to forget anyway. Hmm. Fuck it. What else am I gonna use my money for? Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, I agree, man. I've always got something interesting for people like you. If so, any lucha stariko up science. How could I manage this? Can the Martha take a suppressor? 
My yes. information might well be of use to you, Scott. Well, we finally get to say goodbye to our trusty AK for a little while. Come here. I've always got something interesting for people like you. Ах, неохота мне за хабаром сегодня плестись. Сейчас бы дома оказаться. В гамачке, с книжкой Well, with all that, we are ready to go to Lake Yantar. Meet our friends, the scientists. <laughs> uh, well, if it wasn't... You might be fooled, because that's what most of them are about today. Oh, man. It really is, yeah. With high-fidelity items, suddenly, these are things you feel the desire to pick up and collect. I mean, maybe a little more so. Or maybe I'm just making shit up? Could be. This is another section. It's actually on a timer once you reach a certain point. But you don't know that. And... Oh fuck, this escort mission is so awful. It's so fucking bad. So fucking bad. That, um... Well, I'll show you. I'll just show you as we go along. So right about here, you're going to hit the trigger. So, you're starting to see why I really wanted to get to this class of weapon. Uh, there's just artifacts fucking everywhere in here, it's great. Um, but yeah, these things, they will actually hit where you aim. And it's glorious. I got a Mika, so I'm gonna trade out my slug. You got a bloodsucker somewhere around here. Basically, this whole time, the scientists are trying to fight off the mercenaries, and if you wait too long, they're gonna get to your escort buddy and slay him. Slay him dead. Jagged Alliance. I love those games. Take out a fuck ton of inventory management, though. That's right. And across multiple characters, too. Okay, I'm going to avoid the camera transition here. We can look at it later. But I just want to move in as quick as possible. Here's where they really start pushing. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, buddy. That's the leader of the mercenaries right there. Guy on the radio. He's, uh... We made him dead. But, okay. Okay, I can't relax yet. Our boy's still in danger. Oh my gosh! One of them survived! Okay. Okay, now we can relax. Start 
collecting all this crap. So I'm not exactly bursting at the seams with ammo like I was earlier. So I'm going to be scavenging for a little bit. Do I have the stash I want here? Yes! I didn't even need this barrel armored suit. I guess I could save it for later, though. You know what? Yeah, we'll come back for that. I heard those shotgun blasts off in the distance. Pretty sure those are the zombies. What? No scope for me? Okay. Now, what I like to do here is, since he's safe, I do not talk to him. Oh. And that also means not walking up to him like that, because that'll start the conversation. Oh. Oh yeah, I do want to go down here. Yeah, at this point, if I don't start the conversation with him, I can fuck around as long as I want. The rest of the enemies will stay in their spots. There you go, I got, the, I got the paint tool. Enemies will stay in their spots and he won't go wandering around either. So I just do a little... zip-zooping around here. You can collect some pretty cool stuff. Uh, forget how to get out of this predicament. I mean, why would you need dialogue and subtitles to match up? Come on. This shotgun will be important in a little bit. Alright, so the guns I picked up, uh, one is the Black Kite. It's Desert Eagle in 45. It sucks. We also got one in the high-end rifle round, which works a little bit better. But, God, is it ugly in this game. So now I'm at my leisure to hunt down the rest of these enemies and clear a path for our escort. Because if you don't do this, he's going to just kind of run face first into danger. It, it You can kind of make it work, but I just like to take the sure bet here. I'm actually struggling a bit to remember where all the enemies are. That's how long it's been. Don't worry. I won't struggle too much. Okay, it's not that good. I knew you were there. You just moved. This 
just me or does this does this sound just a little bit like a laser gun? Oh hey Tribarski. Yeah, this one. Oh god, remind me what the year is on this. I want to say it's 2000. 2007, is that right? Yeah, there we go. It's got a it's got a very pew pew sound. Pew pew pew. Yay, do I win a prize? My prize is that I get to keep playing the game. Which works for me. Uh, I think that's everyone we need to worry about. There's a free suit here. I don't need it. Ah, food. Oh, I don't know what my prize is. A worry-free, no-stress escort mission. To be fair, I could have gone a little further. Um, killed a few more enemies, but... This should be good enough. The rest of them are zombies. They're not as much of a threat. Doctor, I'm begging you. We were returning from Yontar when the Mercs shut down our helicopter. I heard that they are looking for information, but I know they will kill us. Okay, I'll help you out. But you go first and I'll follow you. I'm a you see, if he actually did what he said here, it wouldn't be so bad. <laughs> he is a cosmonaut. He's his, his little wrinkly green pajamas. Oh yeah, they spawn behind you too. That's right. I stopped him. See, now I don't have to worry. I can just uh, check these corpses quick while he's running around a little bit. Oh? Do the still living scientists actually follow you here? That's kind of cool. See, this boy, he does not want to wait. He's just bursting at the seams to get where he's going. He's just spinning his pistol while he talks. You go first, and when I see you have reached the end of the tunnel, I'll follow. Beware of the fire traps and look out for hot air distortions. Uh you know, I don't need this. I should I shouldn't have picked that up so quickly. Okay, let's take a second here. These guys have mostly burnt themselves out. This 
see if I can recreate the magic. Eee, look, it's dancing. It's like a little poop it's dancing down the hill. Just a reminder, the rule with the fire anomalies, and with all anomalies, is that if you trigger them, they won't hurt you while their animation is playing. It's only the initial tick of damage that counts. So with that I can kind of just grab everything I want to. Which one is the one I want to keep? Now, let's just watch this guy's amazing traversal. Hey, you did it! Boy's growing up. He's learning how to walk all by himself. And now he's learning to shoot. All right, son. Now you want to hold your breath? No, don't hold your breath. Um, you know what? Maybe just yeah, just go ahead. Gotta hit sometime. Oh, we got it. He got a hit. Uh oh. Okay, if they start firing back, then I'm a little concerned. <laughs> Don't worry, you'll get better. It's, it's not curtains for you just yet. idea. Please, take the gun. We are safe, finally. Thank you for what? Your take the gun! I always want, so here, take this I'm throwing it at your balls. Take, take the gun. I'm sure barkeep will pay you well for this stuff. If you come to our mobile lab in Yantar, we'll give you a real time. And with that, the escort mission is complete. For now. Ooh, it's gonna get worse, my friends. It's only gonna get worse. Oh, okay, the reason these guys are hobbling around, they've all been turned to zombies by the brain scorcher. And now all they know how to do is hobble around and shoot at anything that moves. Which is basically the life of a stalker. Like, just perfectly encapsulated. This moment in time. 
an experience we all share. Hold on. Uh, my... Oh, okay, I'm not gonna do this anymore. I used the scroll wheel at one point and it broke my chat. Exactly, Alex. Exactly. They're living their best lives as stalkers. Not hello, hello. Hello, 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 hello. That's true. This is basically the mini brain scorcher. This is like the first prototype. Hello, hello. I guess. You really get no telephone service out in the zone. Gotta do one more escort mission. One more! And then they'll allow me to have the Psy Protection Helmet. Hello? 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 Ugh, hello. So I wanted to sell you these. Because I don't need them. Oh yeah, and artifacts, because scientists pay a lot. Wait. Gravity. Jellyfish. Fireball. Moonlight. Oh, you want a moonlight? Hello? What am I going to get Hello? for that? Oh, just some first aid kits? Fuck no. Hello? 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 <laughs> Oh, that shit is bonkers. Hello? 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 Wait, did I... I think I had a fireball equipped before. Yes, okay. That's right, I never found a crystal. Sadly. Okay. Yes, I will go first. Please, don't follow me. This part is a mess. He actually took the gun this time. Thank God. Oh 
Oh no. Did I miss some? Is he getting his ass killed back there? Better not. He's really been distracted. Cool. Okay, those lions aren't coming for me. All right, he should be safe. There we go. Just popping his little head out the tunnel. We can get him all the way back to the to the mobile laboratory from here. I can't make out anything in here. I feel like we need a mix of hello, hello, get out of here, stalker. I said come in, don't stand there. And uh Shit! Oh shit! About to break loose. Oh. I'm going this way. Fine. We can't just leave him like that. Just leave him. There is nothing we can do for him. The blowout is minutes away and we won't get through with him. No, Fang. I'm not leaving him. Ooh, nice purple sky. This is the one scripted, uh, quote-unquote blowout in the game. <laughs> yes, and the breathing. Okay, dumbass ended up in a good spot. Oh, did it really not spawn any more zombies? Okay, we might make it out of here in one piece. You make it sound all too easy. That guy over there shouldn't be a problem. <laughs> Tribor, that would be amazing. Oh no. The meme mods. This is how they all begin. Okay, we should be all clear. Let's let him waddle his way back. Hmm. I like that rat running on the treadmill. Hello? Hello? Hello. Hello? Hello. Look who decided to wander in. Wish I had comfy pajamas like that. Really? I'm gonna Hello? I'm gonna keep an eye out for that. Couldn't be any more. Alright, let me adjust the prototype. There's a lot of good corpse stuff coming up. <laughs> He's still all grumbly.
Hello? You Hello? did an excellent job. If the measurements are correct, the prototype should provide you with maximum protection. Item received permission. stone flower? Stalker, now you will be able to break through to the laboratory, but unless you turn off the emitter, you won't last long even with the site protection on. We've estimated an approximate location of the emitter. It is located in an underground facility. I have marked the spot on your map. Vasiliev was working on the lab issue. About a week ago, he and a stalker called Ghost tried That's to get inside. That's a familiar inside. name. A couple of hours later, we felt a major tremor. And after another hour, we picked up a signal from Vasiliev, coming from the swamp. But it died away. And Vasiliev died away with it, it would seem. Tried to find his corpse. He had the exact information on the lab and the way to get into it. There may even be info on deactivating that source of the emission. I've uploaded you all the data we have. Uh, I just realized this text at the bottom is cut off. Oh, they didn't get to voice act that last part. That's fine. Oh, it's just some radiation, don't worry about it. Now, I could I could take my time and Pick these snorks off one by one. And these zombies. Or I could just run up in here. Real quick. We've got all the papers. Oh. We know how to Smash. The source of the emission. Grab all this too. Proceeding to dig into the lab with ghost. <laughs> I missed. Run. <laughs> it's all screwed up. Ghost has gone insane. He must have been affected by the emissions. I I've dropped everything. Let's just take a moment and hang out with the snorks, because they're pretty cool. They sound like lions, and they just want to give you flying hugs. He looks like a friend to me. How can you not love the Snorks, honestly? <laughs> Though I think in England there's a, a TV show called The Snorks, which are a little different than this. So, Europe people might be a little confused. Excuse me, get headshot. You're still following? Buzz off, stalker. That's okay. Okay, I'm looking for an impaled corpse. I think I know the one. <laughs> Is that guy right there? Oh, my back. Yeah, he had a bad time. So, I'm curious, how, like, how is that related to The Exorcist? Because I have seen that movie, but... I couldn't pinpoint that specific imagery. Leg. But whose leg? You may never know. Yeah, there are a lot of good static corpses in this area. Re real fine corpses. Cream of the cream when it comes to dead bodies. The kind you just can't help but stare at. This guy's just like, Bleh. I don't care. Whoa, he's upset. 
Don't look at me when I dance. Don't you know this is zombies private time? Now what I like to do here, there's a few ways to go about this, but I like to climb up and get on the roof. Here we can kind of see what's what and who's who and where and why. Maybe clear a path. Oh, that wasn't bad. I like how the zombies can still run when they hear a grenade. Look at them go. Did that one fall down? Wound? No. Oh, no. Okay. He's awake. Huh. Not as successful as I would have hoped. Shooting me up in the guts. All up in these guts. Where the heck did he go? Thank you for your bullets. Oh, nice. I'll check out that link a little later. Uh-oh. They're doing that thing again. Got a conga line going here? Yeah, I really didn't need to get this one. Oh well. Yeah! You fucker! <sighs> I wasn't ready for that. Excuse me. You gonna say that to my face? <sighs> Can anyone remind me, is the F2000, um, like, is it part of the game? 
Is that a cut gun, or is that completely a mod gun? Because I'd swear there should be one right here. And that's probably from mods, but... At this point, I really can't tell anymore. My memory's starting to get a little jumbled. To get the goldfish, though. Okay, so that's... That's probably a mod. I'm just gonna say that. We'll go with that. But no, isn't the F-2000 in this game? Yeah, it's the... the, the um, I forget what they call it. I've got a different name for it. I don't know why I expect one to be here. Oh well, let's go down into the lab. Or... Just had a better idea. You can get a good view of the whole area from up top here. Oh? I don't know if I've ever broken this box. I don't know if you can even climb that ladder. Uh, another important part of the stalker experience just hanging out at the campfire with your bros. Oh. And then the snork comes along. Oh, it's like a cat. Hmm, we can't really see any of the other things from up here. Oh, I must get even higher. <laughs> Just a couple of guys being dudes. Dudes being guys. Oh, oh, there's an artifact in that building. I always find it neat, to, uh, after you go through an area, to just look at the path you came in and all the other ways it could have gone. But let's head down into X-16, which I think... Hmm. Question, chat. Should I call it here or go through X-16? I have an inkling what you might say, but I want to I want to get a response. Well, there's a grenade. You want me to go hang out by the campfire? Ooh, that's tricky. It's a tricky proposition. I wonder if I could do it. Because they're all facing away. Okay, I do have to worry about these snorks. Hanging out by the campfire is, uh, we may be compromised. Nope. Okay, okay, we still got a chance. Oh, come on. I really had to come this way. Don't do your disco moves at me. I just want to hang out. Why can't we all just chill? 
Y'all too busy growling and jumping and kicking. Just... Just take it easy. Just take it easy. Jeez, it's like fighting Eddie Gordo. Do it. We're headed towards the campfire. Oh, I need to. Okay. Just very slowly. No. No more Snorkus. No more Snorkus McGorkus. Oh. <laughs> okay, this one we don't have to worry about just yet. Hey, bro. Ah. Oh. Isn't it nice? Just hanging out by the campfire with all your friends. This is fun well, it was fun. <laughs> now the snork's gonna eat my kneecaps. Incredible. Oh, uh, they're all... See, you heard that. What the... <laughs> you heard all the enemies go active as soon as the game loaded. So that's the, uh... The sound thing that Shima was talking about earlier. All these snorks are just so rude. Oh yeah, you too? Come on then. Show me what you got. Oh, you got bullets. Where'd you get those? Come on. It's cheating. Show me what you really got. so good. Mm, well, this is probably a good place to stop then. We got uh, Lab X16 to look forward to next time. That's pretty exciting. If you thought X18 was spooky, uh, this one... You know, I, I'd say a little less so. There's a little more focus on action and less on suspense, but uh, I still really like it. I think it's a bit of fun to go through. And... Honestly, at this point, I think... I think with a bit of cheese, we could probably rush to the end of the game. I'm not going to do that, I'm just... Uh, Thinking about the the few stalker speedruns I've seen. Uh, anyway, thank you all for joining me tonight. Uh, we're going through this game a little slower than I thought, but it's also nice to just take my time with it, goof around every now and then, and uh, just like it's like drinking fine wine. You gotta let it sit in your mouth for about 10 seconds. Let the flavors just assault you. Like a breakdancing snort kicking out your kneecaps.
so yeah, um, take it easy, everyone. Hope you enjoyed your uh, long weekend in Canada or your regular weekend in the U.S. And we will all we'll all convene again here someday for a little more stalker. <laughs>